No, I'm just gonna help my computer doesn't crash. But regardless, the same as every recording session, really. But regardless, welcome back to Let's Play The Legendary Starfield. Last time we got started with Spring! AKA World 8. This time, well. We're gonna continue. Asteroids attack. It really does not feel like this will be going on for all that long. This let's play, but I'm gonna check the lobster to see how long, much playtime I have. And that doesn't include like time on the pause screen or pause or whatever. But it'll give me a general idea how long this let's play is. Fantastic! I got this train running smoother than ever. Welcome aboard to my Cosmic Express. My name is Junior, by the way. You know, Mundo, my dad, of course, Daffy. You can just relax now. This train, the train is first class. We'll be there in no time. Chugga, 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 chugga. Oh no, a complication! I totally did not see this coming! Ack, where are those asteroids? Are we in an asteroid field? Close! Marshaf pirates are attacking the train! This could be a problem! Alright, what kind of weapon do, does this train have? Weapons? You mean like cannon and lasers? Right, uh... We don't have those. This is a luxury train. Oh great. We're just fighting them off with soft pillows and fancy silverware. Turfy, get out of here and take care of those pirates. How? I got no idea. You'll figure it out. Head out the door and f over there on your right. Follow the narrow. Follow the arrows to find your way to the roof. Yep. Nine hours. Honestly, in terms of my last minutes, that's actually pretty short. Just because we have to place to beat doesn't mean... I don't suck at my, um, sessions. Well, then I'm going to be right back, because it's dinner time. It's not crashed. Let's continue. This may not seem like it. Like, ah, oh, <laughs> tunnel whiplash, but like, pretty tunnel whiplash. Another is the treasure chest. Tender chest. I'm gonna turn down the game volume slightly. Yeah, I'm still louder than it. Than the game, but yeah. Yeah, just that, yeah. <laughs> Well, that was easy. Yeah, we're literally just doing the same level again, but in reverse! I have no secret exit. 
Well, there is a secret exit in the stage. There is, it is in the train car, probably, most likely. Until I'm proven wrong. Well, the treasures are. I think the ground pound just does more damage, which tends to be a general theme with ground pounds, that they tend to do a lot more damage. I don't know why. Our ground pound desk abilities. And it also works like it's just also the hyper strike. Oh wow, it's literally the same level as the last one, but in reverse. Well, no one needing this episode, it's rewind time. So, plan on counting out the number of baddies. Okay, I'll do that. Here we go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. First try! First try, no save states! Obviously, oh, I, I, I can't save state when I'm in my OBS window. But again, the lower the same level as the last one, but we're doing it in reverse. Which is the thing, I guess. Hi! We got both treasures and the secret. We're, we're fine. Duh. The intense, getting intense. We better head down. Oh shoot, minions! I can't leave right now. Nemo can think of an idea to do. Does does he have an idea? Let me let me run game. I mean, aside from follow the arrows, uh, I don't know what the most plan is. Starfy! We gotta take care of those ships out there, but we don't have any weapons here! I got it! You just dust pit to deflect the rocks! Hopefully the rocks aren't too big! If you should be just a few back, we should be able to make it. Good luck, Starf! Round one! Oh, this is a level. You did it! That was easy. Thank you, Starfy! You really are a legendary hero. Good work, kid. See? Didn't I tell you? What would you do without my brilliant ideas? Great work, Prince of Puff Top. Now sit back. Because we're pulling into our destination. Alright, this is as far as we can go. The castle gate is just ahead. 
Good luck, everyone. I hope you'll save Benaria from Marsh to... With Sarfi and Mosing, we can free my people and save Benaria. Please return safely, Prince Bunsen. Alright, I think it's time to go. Okay. We'll be on patrol in this area just a little longer. You're welcome to aboard the Cosmic Express anytime. Just call. Thank you for everything, Mundo. Mumbo. Mundo. Mumbo. Mumbo Jumbo. <laughs> Redstone Man Pants. See you later, Junior. Points that self. There goes the train again. Ought to be late in another destination. Alright, let's move! Can't take care of Mash Tooth. But what if I backtrack? The game is one step ahead of me. Five arms hit. No, thank you. Lo and behold, there's still more level. Anyways, I've been doing some thoughts about like stuff to talk about, and while I was thinking, then, uh, while I was eating there, was like, like a certain phrase, like, like if you do or, doing what you love, you don't work a day in your life. I mean, I get that, but it also. Not like this. Like, okay, I love doing. No, I'm not getting paid to do this yet. Turn that up a little bit. Yeah, I'm not getting paid to do this yet. Um. We're just gonna be over here. While I get my thoughts out. Like, aside from like a few parts, like some of the, the recording does feel like working. You know, this may not be a daily thing, but that, uh, recording. Because I tend to record a lot in small chunks. Junks over a long period of time, longer period of time, but um, I don't know. Some of them really do feel like I'm just doing this for the, for the sake of YouTube. Half a hero is one of them. Do want to go back to that at some point, and also Pikmin Four was also one of those. Anyways, Serpy, my people, my friends. No, wait. We're not too late. They're still alive. Everyone, hang on just a little longer. Can you get up? No good. Their powers have been stolen by Mashtooth. But they're alive. But they can't move. But can't move. Mashtooth, how could you? You're gonna pay dearly for this, I promise you. You're gonna pay. Bunsen, take it easy, pal. My people gave everything they had to protect me from Mashtooth. Was my friend. No, <laughs> I miss her. Damn it. It's just my mother and father gone. My people are the only family that I have left. Oh no, I died in all your parents. Yep, yep, soon after I was born, both my parents passed. 
passed away. I was so young, I didn't remember much. Poor Bunsen. Anyways, me, that's why. Uh, I'm not, you know what, I'm not gonna talk about family matters. For multiple reasons. I have a good home life, but like, it's not perfect. I'll leave it at that. That's not mean. I can't. No, I. I well, we have this epic badass music, and I'm gonna just completely ruin the fucking tone. I. I generally feel. Bleh, weird esque reading out those kinds of dialogues out loud. Especially with, you know. Gets out of context, because, uh, I don't. I'm not living alone, believe it or not. I've already mentioned this. I don't live alone. I live with the rest of my family. Most of the finding work is hard, and I don't uh, I feel like moving out anytime soon. Yeah. Nah. I just, it just, it, it's not game's fault. It's literally just a me problem. Anyways, continuing. I have to, but fortunately for I made a self-imposed rule that I have to read the dialogue, the fluffing dialogue. So yeah. But my one started me. You have taught me so much. Darby and I are, bo are both princes, but I have been the one who has been in need of constant help. It's time for me to grow up. I have to become a powerful prince and a kind prince. But most important. We are friends who can protect his people. Darcy, thank you for everything, but I owe you. But I have to do this much on my own. Well, let it end like this. I can't. Marsh juice was going down. Blah. Hey, old boys, you Never. I know that never knew his folks. So sad. Doesn't seem for me. So I know what he's been through. Ah, uh, poor Mo. Yeah, have to. Promise to help on some safest people in his family, right, sir? Correct. Oh, wow. This is just about, like, a <laughs> Mario door. Fortress door. And we're still not close. At the end of this level. More of them are dead. Required. I was doing it for the pearls mainly. Okay, Gam. Oh yeah, the pearls. See about that. Is the pearl pearl grinding for the best for all the items in the uh, shop is kind of also why I'm not one hundred percenting uh, true one hundred percenting uh, epic yarn. Well, I'm gonna break the climactic sequence and do this level first. Uh, I don't imagine the final. We're we're approaching the final boss. Sneaky, sneaky. We have. Ten hearts, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we have ten hearts.
Oh, so this is just a goddamn train level again. But all the doors are closed. What's the point then? What's the point of this level, secret level? And all my the air is getting in the way, whatever. But still, what's the point of the level? I refuse. No, I'm not checking them unless. Well, we're going to see once we get to the map if we missed anything. No, but. You you didn't have to repeat the train three times. I want to get the final two levels before post game. The post game will its own spotlight, so we're gonna have a shorter video this time around. But just because it's shorter it doesn't mean we can't do the Mo Show, right? It's the Mo Show! It's with me, Mo! Today's guest is shy about coming out of his shell, Herman! I hear you got some pet fish, Herman. Tell us a bit, bit about that. They aren't just any pet fish, man. They're my adorable little guild friends. Our uh, champions, Pure Brain Cotties. I heard rumors that a rare brain of Cotties that lives that, that lives somewhere deep in the forest, man. I've been trying to find that to find it, but uh, then I'm uh, worried about my fresh call. Cotties would get jealous. That was the Mo Show. Next time. Uh, yeah. Till next time.